So right now I'm on the way to weigh-ins and weigh-ins are the day before. So I'll tell you guys my weight class when I get done with that. So I weighed in in 67.5 kg weight class. Um, I did not cut a whole lot. There was a big myth around you having to cut to lose weight. But it's really not that hard and it doesn't take too long. And it's really easy if you do need to cut. I've done it once and it's not that hard. So day of the competition, just woke up feeling good. Had to wake up at 5.30 in the morning. Um, I'm hoping I'll do good, but we will see how I do. We got about an hour drive up there. And then about an hour of warm-ups and rules. And then it will get started. It's going to be squat, bench, and deadlift in that order. And I, I can break some records in all of them. And then maybe the total record, but we'll see how I do. And we'll see how close I get. So in the top of the screen on the TV, you can see the little red line, and that means that it's state record. It's a little bit blurry, but that's what it says, state record attempt, and that's how you know that I'm going for a state record. Squat. I got a little bit mad at myself after watching the videos. I didn't go quite heavy enough. You could see how deep I was getting. I was just going too low, and I wasn't squatting enough. It was going too fast, but we'll see if I can do better in the next meet. I think I could have shattered this state record if I would have just gone up and decided to bite the bullet, but I didn't. And I guess, you know, there's a learning curve for everybody, and I will have to get used to that next time. So, the reason I filled the bench is because I went to set my lats. I might make a video on that, explaining what that is. And I hit the rack, and it made it to where I couldn't set my lats, and the guy said start. So, I didn't have my lats set, and there's nothing you can do after that. And so, I didn't have as much pressure on my chest, and I just couldn't get it up. We'll see you next time. I should be able to get it my next meet. But we'll have to so see. this is my first attempt, and it is already the state record by just a little bit. And you can see it went up super easy. My second attempt went up easy too, but I'll let you guys watch that. So in this attempt, I beat the state record by 65 pounds, which is huge. And I think that I did good here, and this was definitely my best lift of the competition. When you guys attempt state records, make sure that you always go to the table that has the judges at it because they have to check your clothing to make sure that you're not wearing anything that could help you. And this was also a drug tested meat, so there is a possibility that they could drug test you. They take the top four boys and top four girls for drug testing. And that's how they do it, so they don't have to test everybody. Um, uh, not sore yet. Usually I have knee pain, no knee pain. I think I did great. I broke three state records. I did not get the bench record. 
but I wasn't too far off. We'll see about that in the next meet. I think that I could definitely improve on some of my lifts, but I'm also very happy with where I'm at right now. So I got first place, I won, and this is a medal. It's pretty cool. Uh, there are second and third place medals too that were also really nice. It was pretty fun overall. I think that you guys should do it if there's one near you and you should always try and there's really nothing not fun about it. Everybody's super nice and will always support you when you're trying to do it. So I just encourage anybody to do it. So that's the end of the video. I will post the link for the next meet in the comments. And I also will post a link for the records page in the description. And so you guys can sign up for that next meet if you want to. It's not too bad expensive, and I hope I can see some people there.